What is capital budgeting? Capital budgeting is the process that companies use to make decisions regarding capital projects that typically last for a year or more. These decisions affect the long-term assets on the balance sheet and are crucial for a company's future. Since capital projects often involve significant sums of money, making an incorrect decision can lead to costly consequences. The principles of capital budgeting also apply to other corporate finance decisions, such as mergers and acquisitions, working capital management, and investment choices. These decisions primarily aim to enhance shareholder wealth. The first stage of the capital budgeting process involves generating investment ideas, which can come from any part of an organization. This step is essential as it sets the foundation for the decision-making process. The second step is to analyze these ideas by forecasting future cash flows and evaluating their profitability. After identifying profitable projects, the next step is to plan the capital budget in line with the company's overall strategy. Lastly, monitoring and post-auditing the completed project ensures that the company can assess the success and efficiency of its investment. Several types of capital budget projects exist, such as replacement projects, expansion projects, new products and services, and regulatory or environmental projects. Each type has its unique challenges and levels of uncertainty. Cash flows are evaluated on a post-tax basis, and financing costs are not included in the calculation since they are already factored into the required rate of return or discount rate. Investment decisions in capital budgeting can be made using several methods, including net present value NPV, internal rate of return, IRR, payback period, discounted payback period, average accounting rate of return, and profitability index, PI. However, NPV and IRR are the most widely used. NPV calculates the sum of all discounted future cash inflows against the initial cash outflow. If NPV is greater than zero, the project is considered a good investment. IRR, on the other hand, finds the discount rate that makes the present value of cash inflows equal to the initial outflow. A project is worth investing in if IRR exceeds the required rate of return. The payback period determines how long it will take to recover the initial investment, while the discounted payback period factors in the time value of money. The profitability index shows the ratio of present value inflows to the initial investment, with a value greater than 1 indicating a worthwhile investment.